Well, we're here today uh, to sort of reveal for the first time some of our movie Moana to, that, that will be that is being shown to the Disney um, D23, D23 Expo. Expo for the first time, and it's really exciting to uh, to see a reaction to to uh, some of the elements of our movie, some of the music, some of the voice talent, and and some of the uh, animation. Well, well, there was a, a young fellow by the name of Dwayne Johnson, who uh, many people know. He, we've recorded with him a few times. He's playing the part of Maui, who was a legendary mythic figure of the South Pacific. He was a demigod. He was bigger than life. He was a trickster, a shapeshifter, and pulled up islands out of the sea. And we thought, who better could play somebody mythic than a mythic guy like Dwayne Johnson? And we've had a couple of recording sessions with Dwayne, and he's just, he's, he's, got, he's great with comedy. He's got comic timing. He can improvise, and he's as warm as can be. It's been fabulous to work with. Yes, the song is called We Know the Way, and it's, it was the first song written for our movie by our three musicians, Opataya Fuai, who is a Pacific Island musician, Mark Mancina, the fabulous composer, and Lin-Manuel Miranda, who, if you haven't heard of him, you're not following theater in New York. He just opened and, with his play Hamilton, which is just stunning. So the three of them got together and wrote our first song called We Know the Way, and Opataya and his band came from the South Pacific to they, play it they, for us. Um, they performed it live, and it was... Um, Incredible. It's it was fantastic. just really, really, so, really the, cool. The song itself is a celebration of voyaging, that culture we learned about when we went to the South Pacific on a research trip, how it's such a source of pride for them that they were the world's first greatest navigators that they sailed using dead reckoning, where they just had the stars and their knowledge of the currents, no instruments, and they found their way in these double-hulled canoes across the sea to islands, and they sort of settled the whole Pacific that way. And this song is a celebration of that culture, and it's, it draws on all those roots of both the Opataya and Lynn's uh, narrative sense and Mark's world music sense. It's sort of a fusion of all three. Yeah, it's a little like the Lion King in that it's a fusion of elements, um, and, and really but genuinely, I think, draws from South Pacific music and the roots of that music, which is so such great music and, uh, and such unique music.